This is a Form 3 Plus resin printer from Form Labs. And I had a problem. The printer sat for a uh, longer time than usual without printing. And then when I went to print, the scraper, the thing that looks like this in the tank, would go across the tank and then it would get cockeyed. And then the system would grab it on the way back and it would fix it and it would be okay. I made it through uh, two prints that way, but something wasn't right. And what I figured out was that the resin was getting very thick when it was sitting. Then I tried a brand new tank of resin, okay? And it didn't, things didn't improve. Uh, and then I realized that the tank of resin wasn't mixed well and I was supposed to mix it. Well, how do you mix it? You kind of shake it around and do that kind of thing. Well, I wanted to insert something into my process that would always ensure that my resin was well mixed. So I came up with an idea and uh, I'll show you what it is. Walk this way. So this is what's called a nutating mixer. If I turn it on, it does that. And I saw this in some uh, lab, and I said, this would be the perfect thing. So I went on eBay, and I found myself a nutating mixer. I designed and printed this tray that would hold the resin and plop it into the mixer, except for one problem. This design sucked, okay? I got the dimensions wrong, it didn't fit, and it was annoying to use. Then I redesigned it. This is the redesigned unit. It has a couple of features. It has a couple of big square spots right there, where if I wanted to, I could put a one by one inch square of VHB to hold it to the mixer. It's got a couple of pins to hold the parts together. Let's see how it works. See how that sits? Okay. And then the resin, this side up, slides in there, you turn it on, and that's it. So, I don't know, maybe an hour before you start printing, you put your tank in here. Now, the really super nice thing about the Form 3 printer is that you can walk up to the printer, close the vent on the tank, and just take it out, okay? There's the valve, it's called the bite valve. And you just plop it in your mixer and you mix it. And you don't have to stand around while it's mixing and you don't have to be the one mixing it, okay? So that is my contribution to the art. It's called the nutating mixer. You could build one, but I just found one surplus. If you want the STL, I'll put a link to it in the description below.